What's up everyone, Vince the Longinier here. Today, we're gonna throw down some fertilizer that yields some serious results. Stick around to the end to see the results I got a few days after this application. All right, so it is Memorial Day, and typically I like to throw down some fertilizer on Memorial Day, so that's what we're gonna do today. I've got here DCM 1447, uh, Mini Grand Mix 2, they call it. Um, I'm going to be using this uh, at a rate that gives me three quarters of a pound of nitrogen per thousand square feet. So this is a 35 pound bag. If you do the math, I'm going to need just about 22 pounds of this product to give me three quarters of a pound of nitrogen per 1,000 square feet. This product also has magnesium and iron. So some really good micronutrients here to help really give that uh, dark green look to the lawn. The other thing I like about DCM is that their mini grand technology gives you a homogeneous granular compound that really packs all of these nutrients into every single pellet. This product right here also contains 5% of slow release materials of animal and vegetable origin. Those are the meat and bone meal, hoof meal, feather meal, and cocoa shell meal. So really great stuff here. It's going to really feed the lawn over time, probably 60 days, uh, continuous slow release for this product here. Uh, and to add to that, I've had an issue with acidic soils. So I'm gonna add some calcitic lime. My soil pH has been hovering at around like five and a half. Uh, and I wanna, I wanna bring that up. I'm really trying to hit that sweet spot between like around six, six and a half. So adding lime is going to help us improve that. So we're going to throw some of that down today. And then to top it off, we're going to add some more simple lawn solutions. This is root hume, humic and fulvic acid. Uh, I did do an application of this not too long ago. So uh, we're going to just put some more down. I do this every almost every, every 30 days or so. I'll put some of this stuff down. Uh, so really like using these products. Simple lawn solutions, great stuff. Uh, go check them out. That's going to be a hose end sprayer application, so we'll be using this guy on top of that and just spray over the entire lawn. This bottle does cover 3,200 square feet. I have 4,000 square feet, so I'm, a, I'm going a little bit light on this, but that's okay. I do continuously apply this like every 30, 40 days, like I said, so I'm not concerned about that. It's always good to add some humic acid to the soil and help chelate the nutrients that are already available in the soil for plant uptake. So let's throw it down. First up is the DCM1447. As always, everything I'm using in this video is linked in the description down below. And if you have any questions, please ask away in the comments sections. I also want to hear about the fertilizers you're using this season as well. I've gotten quite a few questions about application timing and when to apply fertilizer. I like to keep it simple. My first application is the very beginning of spring once the flowers start to bloom. Then I apply on the holidays through summer and leading up to Thanksgiving. So this is my Memorial Day application. Then my next app will be on July 4th, followed by Labor Day and wrapping up with Thanksgiving. In between, I put down supplemental applications like the Simple Lawn Solutions and others down. And as we come into the summer months, I'll start lowering my nitrogen rates because we don't want to push the growth too aggressively when the grass is under heat stress. So my July 4th app will be around a half a pound of nitrogen per 1,000 square feet. Next up is the calcitic lime. With my soil pH hovering around 5.5, adding lime will help me bump that up a bit. So I've been using calcitic lime. Soil pH is important because of the grass plant's ability to take up certain nutrients within the optimal pH zone. Right around 6.5 would be ideal. But if you are too acidic, say below 6, or too alkaline, say above 7, you might want to consider adding lime to raise your pH or adding elemental sulfur to lower your pH. Here, I'm putting down a 50 pound bag of calcitic lime over 4,000 square feet in accordance with the bag instructions to raise the pH. Once all the granular products are down, it's good practice to blow off the driveway and sidewalks. Here, I'm just blowing everything back into the grass. 
and if you have nice tight edges, the fur is going to get down in that groove between the sidewalk and the grass and really green up those edges. And to finish off this application, we're going to spray some root hume from Simple Lawn Solutions. This product was sent to me for free in order to show it to you. This product contains humic and fulvic acid and is great for chelating the nutrients in the soil making them more readily available for plant uptake. This bottle right here covers 3,200 square feet, but my yard is 4,000 square feet. So I'm thinning this out a bit, but that's okay because I apply this almost every 30 to 40 days. So I'm always making sure that there's humic acid in the soil and it's there to help chelate those nutrients. And by the end of the week, this is what it looks like. I continue to be impressed with the DCM and Simple One Solutions products. The turf is looking good too, and extremely thick. Maybe a little too thick. The next battle will be the summer heat and staying in front of the disease and fungus issues. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and thank you for joining. Let's pick this guy up. Oh, what do we got here? What the? We gotta take care of this.